Hello and welcome back. This is Sweet Nothing's Crochet's videos and we are working on a decorative basket. We are working on the last bit. So the last bit is making of the handle and the handle we say work about 40 chain. So I've worked 35 there and that's the last 5. Then you need to count off the first 8 5DC clusters. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And you need to work three single crochet in the space between the eighth and the ninth five double crochet cluster. There you go. Three single crochet to nicely keep it secure. And then you work one half double crochet all the way down the 40 chain that you have worked for your handle. To see how to start on my first chainless half double crochet please check my earlier videos and you'll see how you can start without a chain two or a chain three start right and you work one half double crochet in each chain all the way down till you come till the other end and at that end you work two more single crochet to secure and then you fasten off and this is the kind of finish that you'd get at the end of it all not too thick just right now if you are working um, the half double crochet and you're not planning on stiffening your basket at all it will hold like a nice soft carry bag and it can actually take if you're putting uh, chocolates inside that it actually carries and holds quite well looks really pretty too if you need want, or you if you want to keep this uh, let's say on your dining table or on your table and you want to keep chocolates on it in it on a regular basis then you need to stiffen it if you're working with polyester yarn like I have polyester yarn does not accept uh, fevicol or Mod Podge as a stiffening agent so what I have done is I have actually wound uh, woven sorry a very thin piece of metal wire all the way through all the way I don't know if you can see it there but it's gone all the way there you can see it there all the way through until you come to the end and then you just wrap it up and then I took another wire and I have woven it all the way through my handle I think you can see it there so it just goes neatly through because it's a silver wire and I have used silver thread it is a little less visible but then because it's it's wire you can actually get it holding into any shape that you want to and you can actually keep it it stays stiff and therefore it looks like a basket when you keep it on your dining table filled with uh, chocolates all right I have used two colors here but that doesn't really change the pattern in any way you just change the color as you go along please check my earlier videos on how to work with two colors of yarn right then I hope you've had a very enjoyable and creative session today do remember to subscribe sweet nothings videos and I'll see you again really soon. Bye-bye.